guys, how's it going? Master Bucks here. Welcome to something a little bit different. We've got something special on the channel today. I am joined by the man himself, Jake uh, B. Ford Lancer, mate. Welcome to the Master Bucks channel. Today we're going to be doing a little series of yours, the uh, career mode showdown. Yes, we are. I'm excited, man. Let's do it. Yeah, no, pumped. All right, so if you didn't see, uh, we just did one not too long ago. Uh, the video is maybe coming out around about the same time. If not, this one will be a bit later. But if it has come out a bit later, we just did a video on B Ford's channel where we were with, uh, it was with what, Manchester United. Yep. I won't spoil the results or anything, so you can go over there and check it out. But uh, since you are the, the aficionado, the creator of this series, B Ford, would you like to explain for the people how this is all going to work? Yeah, let's do it. Um, it. It could be a bit confusing, but... Pretty much the premise is a career mode guessing game. We start out by giving ourselves a free marquee player. We're gonna get a chance to guess our opponent's player. If we guess it, they're gonna have to release it. We then get to choose some nations we wanna sign players from. Again, we'll have our chance to guess our opponent's nations. And then we'll get into a five minute timer for where uh, we can pretty much sign players from the nations that we chose. And there'll be more guessing involved there. So there's different stages. You'll pick it up, pick it up pretty much as we go along. I think that was fairly a fairly good job at explaining it from from when i first did it with you with the manchester united one a little while back like i was definitely yeah uh it's it's you'll 100 pick it up as we yeah. go along so what we first obviously have our marquee signings which you've signed a player yeah, yeah i've signed a player as you can see right here this is my guy um okay then so what we're gonna do is what we have to show a league that we have written down already um to the camera and if the player the marquee signing that I have written down if that player is from your if yeah the player yeah, the you signed is yeah, from yeah. that league you have to remove him and it's the same vice versa okay yes yes so um cool, cool. do you want to tell me who you signed first because i already got my uh, my league up who All was right, your I'll, marquee I'll player i will just show mine to the camera super duper quick this is the league i'm assuming uh before to sign the player for for his marquee now i just straight up tell you who the player i signed yes is. tell me who you signed i got my uh my league held up interesting here i have gone with a scottish left back by the name of andy robertson from liverpool aka the premier league how have you have you got it or have you screwed me over um yeah i got it i got premier league <laughs> let's go oh he's let's got go. premier league so robbo's gone that's a big one man that's a yeah, that's a fair I shout to you because this team does need fullbacks <sighs> No, I'll take that though. He is yeah. the high. Well, he's the highest left back in the game, right? He, I, I believe, I believe so. Yeah, and the fact that he's like Scottish as well. I'm not yep. going to nominate Scotland as one of my countries. No, yeah, example, uh, so. yeah. That's damn. Uh, uh, oh, that sucks that I have to lose him there. Okay, no, I'll let him go. Yep, he's gone. But uh, there's a good chance he might have got mine. You want to hold your guess up? Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, it's interesting. If you've gone along similar lines as Robertson is, oof, that's six, six million sterling straight out. Um, all right, cool. I have also gone for the premier league so who did you sign i i picked this i always pick this player for whatever reason in these uh career mode showdowns and i went for a player in the league that you guessed for our episode i went with the bundesliga i went for robert uh, Lewandowski. so he is going to be joined Lewandowski. This, this attack is mad actually neymar and bappe Lewandowski. Whew. I mean, without Lewandowski, you've got Icardi, Mbappe, Neymar, Di Maria. Oh. That's I'm very, very surprised. Okay, well, I never would have guessed a striker. Um, yeah. But yeah, I don't know. Maybe you could. I wanted. I, I, I'm going like all that. out attack this episode, man. If I'm not scoring, I think. I think that's. Yeah. That's the motto. That's 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 how we're going about it, isn't it? Yep. Yep. So we, well, you had the release here, so it's a good start for me. Um, next up yeah. is the nations. Okay then. So we have to nominate three name okay yeah, i'm not even gonna try you should definitely try to explain this a little more uh going forward i reckon but yeah. basically what we have to nominate three, three nations uh, nations and we can only sign players from those three nations and if we yeah. guess one of them then you won't be allowed to sign players from that exactly nation. so and then we each get one guess at one of our opponent's nations and if i guess one of his then uh i get to give you whatever nation i want so let's get things started and do you have your guess written down let me let me let you guess mine first. Your nation. Yes. Oh, right. uh, let me let me write mine down. Give me a okay, second. Okay. Yep. Go for it. So, okay. So I have to guess one of your three nations. Let me just show up really quickly to the camera. Right. What nation I am going to go for now? 
if you don't want any spoilers, people, or maybe there's a chance you've probably already seen the video by now, but uh, I, I'm looking to go two for two here. I was able to successfully guess one of your countries last time out, and I'm going to try to go again. All right. You want me to let me, let me, give, me, give me my guess? Yeah, let me, read it, let me read them out. So the three that I went for, Spain, Germany, and Argentina. Oh, Argentina. Very interesting. Uh, Germany is also very interesting, but the most interesting is Spain because he's gone two for two. Oh, Spain, oh man. amazing, Rip. man. Oh, dude. Oh, I was thinking about going back to back and going England again, but I decided, now let's let's switch it up a bit. Spain's a, Spain's oh, a good one, man. Damn. Spain. Oh, That's a big one. That's a big one. I would say out of the, the three that I chose, I'm least worried about Spain because I had the least amount of players okay. in mind, but that still hurts because there's like one player that i really wanted from spain but all right fair shout um you will replace that nation in a second but let me see if i can guess yours who are you signing players from which nationalities i am going to be i actually just need to double check here so it's super quick <laughs> okay so i am going to be signing players from england spain and germany damn dude i'm so bad at this i'm so bad at this I should have wrote down England. At no, I didn't get it, man. I, I did not get it. Oh, did it? Can I guess? Did you write France? No, dude. I actually didn't write France. Actually, right, surprisingly enough. Um, wait. So you can you re can you repeat those? Okay, England. England. Yep. Yep. Spain. England, Spain. And Germany. England, those Spain, are the three. Germany. Fair, man. I went for. Uh, I went for Argentina. So. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Yes. I'm very. I'm very intrigued by your. Uh, Okay, I'm intrigued to see what you're going to do with Argentina because there's like obviously a few names there that you can go for, but Quite a few. Uh, who in Argentina gets into this team? Who's, yeah, very intriguing. All right then, well, regardless, uh, all right then, I think at that point then we just need to, what, sort out our shortlist. Yeah, but you got to give me, one, you gotta give me a sign. nation, man. You uh, you stole Spain from me. Who you replaced oh, it with, Oh, that's right. Man. Okay, yeah, fair enough, fair enough. All right, well, nice. I gave you a strat. I mean, I gave you a, yeah. I gave you Australia in the last one. I I mean like Who was I gonna give you I could give you a little help here, like France, Brazil. You could give me England too. We could both have the same I mean, nation. They're, I, they're, they're obviously very, very good uh, you know, football <laughs> nations. But I'm um kidding. I think I think I'm gonna go with uh, <laughs> my favorite uh, you know uh, American country and when i say american i mean like the whole continent like one of my favorite okay. north american countries uh i'm gonna go with canada oh canada all yeah. right i'll take canada. god bless canada i'm let's I'm, let's go with canada let's do it man let's do canada all right fair enough so right. yeah as jake said we can now shortlist players from those nations and then we'll be back with uh the players we'll have five minutes to sign them sound good beautiful all right let's do it let go Okay, so we are in the shortlist. We've got all of our players lined up, obviously, uh, minus a couple of Spanish players for B4 because your boy absolutely smashed it. But, all right, so we are going to show three players that we are going to assume that the other player is going to sign. And if we can correctly get one of those players, or even if we can maybe get all three, then the other player will have to remove all of those. Is that correct, B4? Or is that what? Is that, that right? That is correct. B4, or have I stopped That is up? correct. So, like, right. literally, I could guess all three of these, and you'd have to release every single one of them, which would be awesome. Oof, I would love that. Would I would tough. love that. That'd be tough. You've already got one. Um, okay. So, I am going to show my players now. Yeah. If you would like to do yeah, the same. Yeah, it up. Got them right here. The people have seen. Yeah, yeah. It's, I, I, I think this is, like, everyone's favorite part of the video, because I have my guesses. <laughs> you have your guesses. We both have our short list stuff. Are you dying? Are you okay? I'm actually dying. I mean, in, obviously, you know, but what the people don't know is that I had a mild case of sudden onset coronavirus yeah. where I just started coughing like crazy um, in the break. But no, all right, aside from that, I will, I okay, I can die another time. For now, we'll finish off this video. All right, so have you got a, a timer? Yeah. A five yep, minute yep. timer? Ready to start whenever. Beautiful. Ready? Count Here we go. Boy. Three, two, one. Five minutes. Here, Here we go. Let's go. Let's do this. Here we go. And we have got a gigantic transfer budget this oh, yeah. time around as well what is it like 500 million yep. pounds or something like that that we're working with so we are we are stacked for cash we can make a bunch oh, yeah. of big signings yeah here. 500 million both of us have so we are chilling <laughs> if one of us runs runs out of money that would be uh that'd be oh, nuts yeah. 
All right, so I am actually, you know what? I, I thought, you know, let's let's go for a Canadian. Let's go for a man. I mean, you could probably guess, right? Surely you haven't written him down. Surely I haven't. Alfonso I Davies. We'll have to... Gotta go for him. Uh, you got it. You were thinking of going with him. I am going with him. Oh my God, Davies is Canadian. Oh, fuck. I mean, it's not like he's that big. He's like 77 rated, but he's still like wait davies is 77 i would have thought he'd be so much higher no yeah he has mad potential though so <laughs> transfer offer for fuck i completely Canada. spaced i don't know why i i when uh, i found it when um i said canada i only said that for the meme of like my favorite north america yeah. <laughs> i got him in too oh, it's well. my first signing let's go yeah all right got him at least i've given you a a country there or at least a dude there that like um what am i saying you can actually like I gave you Australia last time. Yeah, and there's like not much you can you, you can yeah. do there. Um, we used yeah. to do it too. the <laughs> The old rule used to be you get you got two guesses, so you could actually just like you used to be able to just get screwed over if you got both of your nations guessed. But we've we've since limited it to one guess, and I already have two signings in in the first two minutes, so I'm chilling. What about you? God damn, you're smashing it! I, I'm still uh, on yeah, stuck in contracts. <laughs> still dying over there from Corona. I have a third signing. I'm still in. dying. I, 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 I might actually uh, perish before. You got three minutes left. All right, this is the interesting one. Uh, I, oh. I ain't panicking just yet. I got time. Oh, do I go for him, man? It is the most obvious out there. Lionel Messi. Why else yeah, you were would I go choose for Argentina? Why else would I do it? Exactly, right? But we'll... My question to you is, is, is that too obvious? How much money do I have left? Because I am signing people out the freaking wazoo over here. Oh my God. How much, how much would it, uh, how much would it cost you to sign like Lionel Messi? Because like, if you were to, I don't know. Do I do it? Because it is like, how much of your transfer budget is that? Um, that I, I actually do. Potentially if, if I have gone for the obvious answer. It, I mean, he's at least going to be 150 million, I think. I also have Leroy. But that still leaves you here. with three fifty, though. So uh... it's not bad. Okay, we are. Uh, <laughs> no. We're about halfway done, which is actually completely fine. This should maybe be less than five minutes. I actually think it's too much time. All right, <laughs> I have. I think I have five players in in two minutes. Like two minutes, man. I, I'm smashing this thing out. Um, I should probably. I gotta get a bloody move on you. Know, what I do for this last signing. Um, Second. you know what? I need to. I need to have a quick look here. I'm gonna so FIFA it up. Um, I need a. So FIFA. Are you going for any fullbacks here? Because uh, I'm definitely going for some fullbacks, no doubt. Dude, I, that's like the only that, like it's like the only I downfall to see with this man, right? <clears throat> get this big boy in too. Oh, what do I go for it for this last oh, one. Oh, now we're getting somewhere. I don't know what to do. I am. I don't know what to do. Oh, well, I did that. I just did a thing, oh. and I have seven I have million. No, I have no idea how. I have no idea how much money I have. I might be able to straight up buy every single player in my short I list. Practically I practically did. I know I. I should have put more players in my short list because of how much budget do I have? Uh, office. Oh, actually no. <laughs> oh shit! I might not be able to grab this. Uh, this you have exactly a minute up. left. Dude, I absolutely like this might be the best I've ever done in one of these videos. I literally spent all my ah. money. I'm I, I'm I was done with a minute and 30 left. This is the fastest I've ever smashed through it. And I have so <laughs> many players in here. Let's go, man. Damn, you're done. I'm very much Am done. I, able to, uh, I could try advancing ahead and seeing if I could sell a player. No, yeah. Oh, I actually probably should have considered that because I have these two freaking. I have Icardi, Cavani, who aren't even in my starting eleven. It's kind of a waste. <coughs> you know, I think I'm gonna do my. Uh, I, I'm gonna do my. I'm gonna retire. I think I'm. I'm probably good. Yeah, I'm out too. I think in the at the end of the day, I'm pretty happy with the team that I that I'm gonna end up. Putting yeah, you in. got yourself ten seconds anyway. So, whatever you don't have okay. in the team Please. now, I mean, yeah, eight seconds. I'll just chill here. I'm. Very happy with what we finished with, boys. Very, very happy. Two, well, one. Timer is done. If there you have gone with Messi, I wonder how happy you will be. We will see. Oh, God. All right. Um, do we want to just, do, like, your players in? Throw your players in and we could jump right into this. All right. Let's do it. We have assembled our teams, our ridiculously stacked teams. At the end, okay. Can I ask, at the end, how many signings do you think you made? I'm not even sure myself, but it's probably like six or seven. 
Uh, I think I had five. One. Okay. I think I had five-ish. I think. All right. If you went for five and we had five hundred million, you were talking about Messi before. When you said Argentina, immediately I thought, okay, Messi surely has to come into the equation. But at the same time, I wonder if that was a bit too bait or if you just went bugger it and you just went all in. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll be very intrigued. But okay, um, would you like to go first? Would you like to tell me your three players and I'll let you know if you've nailed any of them? Yeah, so I'll hold them up and you read out who you uh, who you signed. Who I've signed? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God, there'll be a few, there'll be a few of them. Um, you know what? I think there might be a better way to, for me to do this. Give me a spell. I... Uh, We'll just go back to my transfer hub. So that way I'll be able to see everybody. Um, okay. Are you set? Yeah, I'm set. All right, then. Uh, yeah. I think in the end we signed... Not seven, actually. We might have signed eight. All right. So I have David Silva. 33 years of age. Spaniard. 87. He's not even in the starting 11. That's how tough it is to get in. I've got Marco Royce. I have got Carvajal at right back. I have got... Mark andre to Stegen, 90-rated goalkeeper in there. I have got Trent Alexander-Arnold, 85-rated right back. I've got at left back because you took my Robbo. I needed to go for another left back, so I went with Jordi Alba, which I am thinking if you were if you were really smart and switched on, I'm probably the most nervous about that one. Uh, Thiago is also the other one that I picked up as well. Um, and yeah, they're the only one. So what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven players right there that we signed. Did you? That's a lot. Did you get any of them? I don't know if you just heard that sound of the whiteboard hitting the floor, but I did not. You did not, dude. I am so pissed at myself today. Maybe it's because like um, we're just bringing back this series for the first time in the in like a year. I am still, extreme, still, a bit, still a bit rusty. I'm a. I am extremely rusty, man. Again, I don't. So I was. Um, I was close with a few of them. For whatever reason, I'm still on this Sancho thing. If you watched the last episode, I was like, he keeps picking England. Maybe he'll throw mm. Sancho at that right wing. But you just keep you keep wanting it to happen. Nah. I, I want it to nah, happen. It has not if, happened. If I was gonna get if if I was gonna get Sancho, I was gonna get him for Manchester United, but even then I was too nervous. Nope. And in the end you did actually pick him, didn't you? So ah uh, God. Alright then. So I'm in the clear. Yeah. That's, you got my Robbo, but all my seven signings I've been able to keep. That's that's big. I also went for Neuer as a backup goalkeeper in case Stegen didn't work out. And you picked him up in the Manchester United one, didn't you? Jamie Vardy. I was going to, um, yeah. Oh, you were going to? Yeah, yeah. But I, I, I did not know Jamie Vardy is 86 rated in this Dude, game. Dude, he's high Holy rated, shit. man. So I just, even though there's no need for another striker, I was like, oh, maybe we'll just chuck another attacking option yeah, up there as well. I also but wrote, all right, then. I wrote down Kane too, which was probably a dumb move on my part. But like, I don't know. Fair enough, man. You are... I, I think that Ter Stegen's going to be big for you because goalkeepers and simulations are massive, but like, yeah, Nava should be good at 87. All right. I'm nervous, man. I'm nervous as hell that you guessed a few of my dudes. Um, do you want to <laughs> okay. hold up your picks? I will hold up my picks once again for anyone that needs the reminder. Right. So, um, uh, I signed, um, the Canadian Alfonso Davies. Like I said, we got him in. I left, I signed two left backs. I don't know why I did it. I signed Tagliafico as well. The, uh, oh, Argentinian. God, I, I knew that you would go for him, but I didn't put him down. So kind of obvious, go. yeah. I was pissed that yeah. you uh, took away Spain because I don't know why I didn't write them down. I as well was going to go for Carvajal and Jordi Alba. Like, why? I should have I should have guessed both of them. That was so dumb on my part. Didn't guess either. Yeah. Um, I also went for Tony Cruz, Joshua Kimmich, yep. Leroy Sané. I, I, Leroy Sané was one of those I was like, he was on my short list and I had extra money. So I was like, I don't know what else to do. Leroy Sané, get in. Fair be enough. on the bench. Yeah, fair enough. And then Lionel Messi. Yeah. Okay. You did go Lionel Messi. Well, I was in the camp of... He's going Argentina. Surely that's a bit too bait. Even though Di Maria, technically, if you're looking at that front four, is one of the weaker. But you'll be happy to know that I did not go for Lionel Messi. So you are keeping... You're Lionel Messi. But it's not all good news. Oh, shit. Because I may have played you with the whole Canada thing. Because obviously everyone knows there's only one good player from Canada, and that is Alfonso Davies. So he is out, even though he's only, what, like high 70-something uh, rated? Bro, you baited me so hard. <laughs> I know. I just, well, I originally, at the time, I was only saying it for the meme of, oh, my favorite North American country is Canada. But then I realized, oh, wait a minute. Didn't... 
didn't a Canadian just absolutely light up Chelsea in the Champions League? So I was like, okay, maybe I'll just jot him down as a fail safe in case you were going to go for any Canadian player. It was going to be him. So, all right, I've wiped out one player. That's it, I'm though? I'm a bit pissed at myself that I... I'm a bit pissed at myself I didn't go with Messi. Yeah. Because instead I went with Dybala. I thought maybe you'd like try to pull a sneaky one and still go for a pretty good Argentinian, but not the best. Um, and I also went with a fullback, Trent Alexander-Arnold, but I see you've gone with, a, what, Kimmich. Yes. You're going in that position, have you? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Nah, good shout as well. All right. So, no, in the end, you've lost Davies, but that's probably, over, like, in terms of overall, he's probably your lowest yep. rated player that you picked up. So, okay. I get a little, I don't know. Little ego boost for getting one player right, but ultimately I don't know how big a difference it's going to make. So uh, yeah, that yeah. one probably won't be. I'm I'm actually really glad I signed Tagliafico now because yeah, losing Alfonso Davies isn't as big of a loss. But I think we're both looking at pretty evenly matched teams, except for the fact that my attack literally might be the best attack ever assembled in FIFA. Yeah, I I've still got the same front. Four. Yep. If we're still going with four two four. Are you the same? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so four two four. It's the same front four. Um, I have got just Thiago moved into the midfield alongside Verratti. It's the defense that really has had the overhaul, and yeah, obviously to stay in goals. Well, oh yeah, hundred so we'll percent. But my bench is ridiculous as well. Oh yeah, so. my bench is crazy too. But no, man, <laughs> Neymar, Mbappe, Lewandowski, and Messi as a front four. Could you imagine playing against that? That is. Absolutely not. It's terrifying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Should we... Oh dear. All right. Then. Should we do it? So let's, do uh, it. let's start. Uh, let's get advancing to the first of June. Yep. First of June, and the way it works is whoever has the most points in league gun. It's not based off place in the table. It is strictly points. Very good. First of June. I have actually made the uh, the Coupe Nationale final. Yeah, it is. Well, I actually okay. simmed past yeah, it yeah. too. So. All right. I'm gonna do it. Yep. Do Just it. do it. What did you win? I did. I, and I was also in the Champions League final. Oh, oh. I, oh, damn. Okay, I didn't make the Champions League final. I think I got knocked out in the semis by like Barcelona or Did something. Did you? Like okay. That. Yeah. That could be bad Barcelona. for me though, man. I, I, I we're gonna check the or check the table, but I beat Barca in the final, so I got a chance to win the treble Ooh, this that'd year. That'd be nice. Yeah. Um, okay, I won the I won the Coupe Nationale final four 0 so that's a bloody banger as well. All right. Oh yeah. Let's have a look at. Oh. <laughs> well, actually, look. I tell you what. I've had a look at the league. Um, I'm going to say one thing. I have gone invincible. Not a single L taken for the whole season. But our team is ridiculous and yours is too. So I, I still don't want to, I don't know. I feel super confident, but I don't want to say anything too early. Like, okay, how many points did you get? Well, here's what I'm going to say first, because this is career mode. This is FIFA 20 career mode. And if anyone plays League on, plays a League on career mode, you will know that PSG always wins the league. They always oh, yeah. win the league. So I am also atop the table. I am okay, also good. invincible. Oh it comes God. down. It, this actually might come down to goal differential. All right. I'm not even going to tell you my points. How many, how many wins do you oh have? God. The fact that you're invin the saying that you're invincible at least indicates that you've drawn at least a game. So if you'd won all your games, you'd have mm -hmm. just said I'd won all my games. I've drawn. Okay. I have won 36 games out of 38. How many of you? Sir Masterbucks, you have taken no. the dub. Congratulations. Oh, the dub. Oh, oh my man. God. I had 35. GG, dude. Oh, my goodness. Uh, you got it done by a point. Yep. In the Manchester United one of these, and now I've taken it out by one victory. Wow. Two points in the end. So wow. I'm on 110, I assume you're on 108. Yep, that is it. Oh my GG's, God. GG's, dude. Wow, man. I am, right, I'm over here looking at my team sheet now, and I had a, like so many injuries. That definitely could have played a role, man. Maybe, injuries. Maybe the, maybe the Champions League final did. Maybe, if you had like a draw in your like recent results or something. Yeah, I kind of want to check that out. But my top goal scorer, freaking Neymar with 48 goal. Oh my God. Neymar 48, Lewandowski 32, Mbappe 23, Messi 22. <laughs> Jesus. God, and I God still damn. didn't beat you, man. I mean, no wonder we won the travel. I mean, my Neymar went hard. You, I mean, your Neymar obviously went hard. Yeah. But mine got 53, 53 goals and 26 assists. 
in Damn. 58 appearances. So let me let me do some quick maths. That's 79 goals and assists that is combined a... from 58 appearances. That's insane. That is, That's actually that crazy. 36 crap. goals and 16 assists in 38 league on games that that's, is mental that no that's actually he did absolutely insane. i'm gonna say he did nothing for me in the champions league he got like five goals five assists in about 10 games but like league on he has absolutely annihilated it we got Mbappe on 33 cavani who i had on the bench and he's got like 18 goals for me Icardi with 13 royce with 12. wow that's crazy man and i i don't think this affected me at all because this was like a game that was in between my last like, basically what I'm trying to say is I, the last game I played in Liga and I drew, which cost me okay. the episode. Literally, the last oh, game. Unbelievable. I don't, I don't know if the Champions League may have paid, played a role or not, but that freaking hurts, man. GG on the dub. That's a crazy finish. Yeah. Holy crap. That, that That is nuts. The fact that it's gone. That Okay. You've got 108 points. That, that has to be a record that stands the test of time for a very long time in this series, surely. 108 points. Yeah. And it's not enough. Oh, yeah. I, especially nah. with PSG, like, PSG, Liverpool, and Piemont do Calcio are just, like, the three teams that are, like, I feel like they're always dominating. You could throw, like, City in there, too. Barcelona, Real Madrid are always kind of back and forth. But, like, man, yeah. that's mad. GG's, nah. dude. I Yeah, GG's. I, I went back, and I, it's intriguing to hear that you drew your last game of the season. The last league on game that I drew was back in February of 2020. So Holy we had a solid run of like, oh, what would it be? 10, I'm going to have a guess. Yeah. Just a little over 10, around 10 game win streak. Just, yeah. to, secu just to seal it. Oh, clutch. Clutch from PSG. Well done. All right, then. We are, we're wrapped up then. Well, thanks again, B-Foy, man. Appreciate uh, yep. having me, uh, or appreciate you having me on and uh, making me be a part of the series, mate. Again, if you haven't seen... Uh, then go over to Beforge channel and check out the uh, Manchester United career mode showdown that we did. And if you haven't heard of the man himself somehow, then make sure you uh, subscribe to his channel as well. The links to everything will be in the description down below. But I reckon that'll do it. Once again, Jake, cheers. Appreciate you uh, Appreciate you joining me, mate. Oh yeah, dude, no All worries. Right, sweet. Uh, until the next one though, guys. Thank you very much for watching. My name's Master Bucks. Catch you later. Bye-bye.